Yes, royal family. Blessed love and greetings. This is the African Liberation Network. I am the host, Honorable Prophet Daniel. And this is the first episode of a new program called Health Strength and Restoration, which is done by a collaboration of the Bobo Shanti Study Group and the Women's Freedom Liberation League, the Ethiopia Africa Black International Congress, Church of Salvation. At this time, I'll turn it over to Honorable Prophet Clarkey to say a prayer to begin the program, my Lord. My Lord and Empress, to the royal viewers of the YouTube family, heart of love, uh, we give reverence in the name of our God and King. Emmanuel, Salasia, Ja, the Father. Glory be unto the Father, unto the Son, unto the Holy One of Creation. As Ja was in the beginning, as now and ever shall be. Ja will without end. Salasia, Ja, the Father. May I continue on chanting Psalm 133. We all are good and all present to the virgin and sister and to do it together in unity. It is the precious ointment upon the head, a random upon the beard. Even Aaron's beard are went down to the skirt of his garments, as the dew of woman and the dew that descended upon the mountains of Zion. For there the Lord commanded his blessings, even life forevermore. Most high, Salasia, Jah, Master Farai, out of love to the royal family, my Lord and Empress. All royal listeners of the YouTube family, I do hand over the floor to Empress Mizi, Royal Empress, heart of love with our him, my Lord and Empress. Mighty Jehovah, Jah, Master Farai, Master Blessed greetings to one as one and all, you know, as we get here tonight, you know, to on this meeting, you know, this panel that we that we are, you know, talking about our goodies, you know. And before we start, we are going to sing a hymn to uplift, you know, our spirituality. You know, in righteousness of salvation, you know, we give thanks to each and every one, you know, as you take time out of your busy schedule to really listen to us keenly in what our research is after, you know, to show the item about your goodie and how it is made up. You know, so let us give thanks and praise my style, Celestia. Yeah, Rastafari. So I'll ask the honorable prophet. Daniel, to find this hymn. Uh, uh, this hymn is there to me, because it was the hymn that my kingman that is missing love very much, right? The hymn is, my hope is built and nothing less. So I'm asking Jad Daniel to do the honors and to find the hymn and to track it for me, please. Give thanks, my Lord and Empress. Yes, honorable, give thanks. As the music is healing and medicine in the same way. Yes. We are, you know, going to open with hymn number 902 from the Sacred Songs and Solos. My hope is built on nothing less than Negus' blood and righteousness. <clears throat> My hope is built on Nothing less than Negus' blood and righteousness. Than Negus' blood and righteousness. I dare not trust the sweetest frame. I dare not trust the sweetest frame. But wholly lean on Negus' name. But wholly lean. On Negus' name. On Christ the solid rock I stand. On Christ the solid rock I stand. All of the ground is sinking sand. All of the ground is 
sinking sand. All of the ground is sinking sand. All of the ground is sinking sand. When darkness hides his lovely face. When darkness hides his lovely face. I rest on his unchanging grace. I rest on his unchanging grace. In every high and stormy gale. In every high and stormy gale. My anchor holds within the veil. My anchor holds within the veil. On Christ the solid rock I stand. On Christ the solid rock I stand. All of the ground is sinking sand. All of the ground is sinking sand. All of the ground is sinking sand. All other ground is sinking sand. Chorus, I salvate salvation. I, 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 Christ the solid rock I stand. On Christ the solid rock I stand. All of the ground is sinking sand. All other ground is Sinking sand. All of the ground is sinking sand. All of the ground is sinking sand. His oath, his covenant, his blood. His oath, his covenant, and his blood. Support me in the whelming flood. Support me in that. Ah, well, men flow. When all around my soul gives way. Then all around my soul give way. He then is all my hope and stay. Be all in death, my hope and stay. On Christ the solid rock I stand. On Christ the saw. Little rock I stand. All other ground is sinking sand. 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 When he shall come with trumpet sound. When Josh shall come with Trumpet sound. Oh, may I then in him be found. Oh, may I then in him be found. Clothed in his righteousness alone. Clothed in your righteousness alone. Faultless to stand before your throne. Faultless to stand before that a throne. On Christ the solid rock I stand. On Christ the solid rock I stand. All of the ground is sinking sand. All of the ground is sinking sand. All of the ground is sinking sand. All of the ground is sinking sand or is humming and you know holy okay. mount zion 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 now lord holy mount zion zion Jovia, ja. Ja. <laughs> Rastafari, my hope is built and nothing less, family, but Negus' blood and his righteousness. I dare not trust the sweetest frame, but I and I, his children, just lean under the name. Jehovah, Jah, 
Jedi. Rastafari. <laughs> yes. And you know, give thanks again as we will return, turn over the floor to one of our researchers, you know, the first speaker of this moment, you know, on this platform here to give you your first lecture about your kidney is the Honorable Empress Cindy. Ready, Sister Cindy, let's do it. Blessed love. Blessed love, Honorable Empress Miriam. Give thanks for that lovely hymn. You know, it's much needed in this time. And so I give thanks for that. Give Blessed thanks love. for the Honorable Prophet Jadanya and the African Liberation Network. And yes. give thanks to the other empresses, Honorable Empress Lily May, yes. Honorable Empress Rachel, and Honorable Empress Dion, and the Honorable Prophet Jack Clarkey. Give thanks for all. Also, I would like to give thanks to the EABIC, um, the Women's Freedom Liberation League, and also all the viewers on YouTube. Give thanks. And so, as Empress Miriam stated, my name is Empress Cindy, and today I'm going to be discussing the topic of kidneys. The kidneys are two reddish brown bean shaped organs found in vertebrates. They are sandwiched between the diaphragm and the intestines, closer to the backside of the abdomen. The kidneys are located on the left and right <clears throat> retroperitoneal space, roughly the size of a closed fist. Each kidney measures about 10 to 12 centimeters in length in adult humans. The kidneys receive more blood than all other organs except the liver. Kidneys receive blood from the, from the paired ren renal, renal arteries. Blood exits into the paired renal veins. Kidneys remove waste products and extra water from our structure. Each kidney is attached to a uterer, a tube that carries excreted urine to the bladder. What are the functions of the kidneys? The kidneys are important because they filter blood, keep the right amount of fluids in your structure, help make red blood cells, and help keep blood pressure under control. The kidneys also help in keeping our bones healthy. The kidneys perform many crucial functions, including maintaining overall fluid balance, regulating and filtering minerals from blood, filtering waste materials from food, medications, and toxic substances, creating hormones that help produce red blood cells, promote bone health, and regulate blood pressure. Your kidneys are responsible for controlling blood pressure, building healthy bones, balancing pH levels, filtering blood, and giving you energy. Why are the kidneys so important, you may ask? Mm -hmm. Most people know that a major function of the kidneys is to remove waste products and excess fluid from the structure. These waste products and excess fluid are removed through the urine. The production of urine involves highly complex steps of excretion and reabsorption. This process is necessary to maintain a stable balance of body chemicals. Excuse me. Yes, of body chemicals. The critical regulation of the body salt potassium and acid content is performed by the kidneys. The kidneys also produce hormones that affect the function of other organs. For example, a hormone produced by the kidneys stimulates red blood cell production. Other hormones produced by the kidneys help regulate blood pressure and control calcium metabolism. Moving on. Chronic kidney disease and some causes. Chronic kidney disease is defined as having some type of kid kidney abnormality or markers such as protein 
in the urine and having decreased kidney function for three months or longer. Some kidney conditions are inherited, meaning it runs in your family. Others are congenital, that is individuals may be born with an abnormality that can affect their kidneys. Diabetes, pardon me, is a leading cause of kidney disease. High blood pressure, also known as hypertension, is another common cause of kidney disease. How does kidney disease affect people by race? Black Americans are more than three times as likely and Latinos 1.3 times as likely to have kidney failure compared to white Americans. Some risk factors to kidney disease, also known as renal disease include diabetes, high blood pressure, being 60 years or older, having a family member with kidney disease, diabetes or high blood pressure. Also, if you are Black, Latino, Asian, Pacific Islander, or American Indian. Over time, kidney disease can lead to kidney failure. It can also cause heart and blood vessel disease. It can also cause other health problems. People with risk factors should get tested because in the early stages of kidney disease, most people do not have symptoms. Kidney disease can be treated with dialysis or holistically with herbs. Some ways to protect your kidneys are to keep blood sugar, blood pressure, and cholesterol levels under control. Losing weight is also helpful eating healthy meals, getting regular exercise, not smoking and limiting alcohol consumption. Avoiding over-the-counter med medication is also advisable. Symptoms of chronic kidney disease include fatigue, insomnia, itchy skin, frequent peeing, bubbly or foamy urine, swollen ankles or legs. Advanced stages would be loss of appetite, nausea and vomiting, a bad taste in the mouth and bad breath, a metallic taste <clears throat> may smell, you know, that may, um, you may smell that in your mouth and one could also experience tremors. Moreover, racial disparities in treating diabetes, hypertension and kidney disease uh, poor access to insurance and medical care leading to delayed diagnosis. Faster progression of kidney disease can also affect people. Kidney failure and its final stages is life-threatening if left untreated. Okay. When our kidneys are healthy, they perform powerful and important tasks. Some of the foods we eat can boost the function of our kidneys while others restrict their performance. If you do develop kidney disease, it is important to remember that every case is a bit different. So it is essential that you talk with your doctor or herbalist to determine which foods would be, would be best for your individual needs. So right now I'm going to list some healthy foods and herbs that one can take in assisting with kidney disease. Number one is watermelon. Watermelon is healthy because it's full of lycopene, an antioxidant that helps break down harmful free oxygen radicals. It prevents kidney injury and therefore, and therefore is a kidney friendly food. Pawpaw seeds or papaya seeds. The potassium present in the fruit is a huge supporter of kidney health. It cleanses out the toxins deposited in the kidneys and reduce the accumulation of uric acid in the blood. 
Papaya seeds also play an important part in keeping kidney, kidneys healthy. Cucumber is a good vegetable choice for kidney failure patients because it is a natural kidney cleanser and it can help the kidneys to excrete more waste, toxins, and acids from the kidney. This, this can, on one hand, relieve the patient's symptoms and discomforts. On the other hand, it can help reduce further damages to renal functions. Another important food to, to take in is plantain root juice. Plantain root juice offers great hope for all forms of kidney problems and diabetes. It promotes the flow of urine and helps metabolism. Another food on the list is blueberries. Blueberries and other dark berries like strawberries and raspberries are among the best sources of antioxidants to help protect your kidneys. In addition, they are certainly better than any sugar, sugary alternative. Next on the list is cauliflower. Cauliflower is high in vitamin C, K, and B, which means it's full of antioxidants and is a great source of fiber. Another um, healthy food would be olive oil. This healthy fat has anti-inflammatory properties and as a monosaturated fat, it stays stable at high temperatures during cooking. Using extra virgin olive oil will give you a greater amount of antioxidants added to your favorite dish. Garlic. When you suffer from kidney problems, it is beneficial to avoid salt. Garlic can give you the flavor you crave by using garlic powder instead of salt in recipes. Plus it adds a great dose of vitamin C and B6. Next on the list is bell peppers. Colorful bell peppers are full of antioxidants like vitamin C and vitamin A. They are low in potassium and taste great in all types of recipes. You can eat them raw in salads or with dips or even bake them and stuff them. Another great food choice for this is cabbage. This veggie is full of vitamin K, vitamin C, and vitamin B, plus insoluble fiber to keep digestion moving and ease bowel movements. Arugula is a green leafy vegetable full of antioxidants and vital nutrients. It is a particularly good choice since it is low in potassium, which is beneficial for your kidneys and it helps to lower blood pressure. Um, next on the list is cranberries, red grapes, apples to prevent constipation and reduce cholesterol. They are low in potassium, phosphorus, and sodium. Pineapples is a sweet fruit, low in sodium and potassium while still offering a significant amount of vitamin D. Next on the list is water. Never forget to drink water and keep it by your side. You have to stay hydrated and keep your kidneys functioning in the most optimum way. Next on the list is onions. Onions are another perfect addition to a recipe for those looking to skip the salt. Onions and garlic used together and cooked in olive oil gives you the best kind of kidney-friendly flavor. They are each high in vitamin C and B and will bring great benefits to your digestive system as well. We also have macadamia nuts. Most nuts are not recommended for those with kidney issues, but macadamia nuts are an, are an exception. They contain healthy fat plus B vitamins. Shiitake mushrooms, a great plant-based protein Shiitake mushrooms are an ideal food for those with kidney issues. They are better than white button and portobello's since they contain much less potassium. 
Radishes are a great substitute for salt in all kinds of dishes and are also an excellent source of vitamin C. These vegetables also provide antioxidants to decrease a person's risk of heart disease. Turnips. Potatoes and winter squash are not recommended for someone with kidney issues, but turnips are a great alternative. They are loaded with fiber and can be mashed or roasted to become the perfect side dish. Some helpful herbs would be stinging nettle, dandelion root, black cohosh, ginger, turmeric, beetroot juice, ginkgo biloba, hydrangea root, horsetail, marshmallow root, juniper berry, uva ursi, celery root, and goldenrod. And lastly, researchers have concluded that a regimen of a healthy plant-based diet rich in fruits, vegetables, legumes, cereals, whole grains, and fiber and low in red meat, salt, and refined sugars may reduce the risk of early transitioning in people with chronic kidney disease. Give thanks, my Lord and Empress, Holy Emmanuel, Celestia, Ja Rastafari. Give thanks for the moment, Ja Daniel, and I will present the floor to Honorable Prophet Ja Clarkey. Give thanks. Empress. I love to the YouTube viewers also and to the hosts. And this segment really, really segment putting in the, the goodie. So as we hear the Empress, we consider you know, the structural organ, which is the kidney. So something skeptical then the kidney. Now, um, viewers, I just give a little insight that kidney also do function liver too. So, in certain any reason, we we'll do see the liver come up also as an example with the kidneys. So, I continue and read from the good book, in the book of Leviticus, chapter three. The man will lie. So that's the answer. That's the problem. This. We're going to read about at this time. As in all of, all of it. It was based upon the sin offering at that time. The peace offerings. And one of the different offerings, which is the meat offerings. Now we go always see the kidney come up because it's at the day with the blood. Now at that time. The atonement on the altar was always made. So we see the coming up here. Continue and read in the book. I love it. From verse 1. The man will lie, so that's the idea. That's the fire, verse 1. And if his oblation be a sacrifice of peace offering, a male or female offer it with for the Lord. The silly offering does not be without flesh, any fault. And he shall lay his hands upon the head of his offering and kill it. Blessed Jack Clark, he is having a technical difficulty at the moment. Yes, he has, baby. 
Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. His, his audio disconnected for a minute, so we'll just give him a moment to okay. come forward again. Yes, we My know you have difficulties. My Lord, God, and my Lord, Yes, my Lord. Do you hear me, my Lord? Yes. Yes, we hear in your jack locks. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Um, continue on reading. From verse 2, Leviticus chapter 3. And he shall lay his hands upon the head of his offerings and kill it at the door of the creation. And Aaron's sons, the priests, shall sprinkle the blood upon the altar round about. And he shall offer of the sacrifice of peace offering, an offering made by fire unto the Lord. The fat that covered the inwards and all the fat that is upon the inwards. And the two kidneys and the fat that is on them which is by the flanks and the call above the liver with the kidneys, it shall be taken away. So we see you now the offering made by fire here. Yeah. You know, just natural. Through the consecration, through the sons of the priests, wronged about the altar. So I just continue and read here. And even son shall burn it on the altar upon the burnt sacrifice. You know, which is upon the wood that is on the fire. It is an offering made by fire of a sweet savor unto the Lord. Or the man will ask, shall I say, just So we see just natural, my Lord and Empress, and to the royal viewers, that is something within a symbolic state representing the atonement of blood on the altar. So the blood carry unclean. The blood and the offering must be acceptable now. You know? So just give thanks to the moment as I of the kidney, my Lord and Empress, Prince and Princess, royal viewers. I do hand over the floor to Empress dear, my Lord and Empress. <laughs> Blessed love, my Lord and all Empress. Blessed love, Ja Daniel and all royal loved ones here today. If thanks to be here to talk about the liver, the functions and foods and herbs of the liver. Blessed love, holy Emmanuel, I last lecture, Rastafari. But I'm going to speak about the liver here today. And my research team consisted of Empress Maisie, Empress Cindy, Empress Rachel, and of course myself, Empress Dior. What is the liver? The human liver is the first largest gland and the second largest organ after the skin. It weighs about one and a half to three kilograms and is located in the upper right-hand portion of the abdominal cavity beneath the diaphragm and on top of the stomach near the right kidney and intestines. The size varies on how tall you are and how much you weigh. The liver is an essential organ performing hundreds of functions necessary to sustain life. It's also a gland because it makes protein and hormones that other parts of the structure needs. <laughs> what does the liver do? The liver regulates most chemical levels in the blood and it excretes a product called bile. This helps carry waste product from the liver. All the blood leaving the stomach and intestines passes through the liver. The liver processes this blood, breaks down, balances, and creates the nutrients 
and also metabolizes drugs into forms that are easier to use for the rest of the structure or that are non-toxic. When a person has a liver problem, one of the most common symptoms is jaundice. So with jaundice now, the skin and the whites of the eyes turn yellow because of too much bilirubin in the blood. Bilirubin is a yellow waste product the liver gets rid of when it breaks down red blood cells. Higher levels of bilirubin indicate a possible problem in the liver. In addition, higher levels of bilirubin can indicate a buildup of fluid in the stomach area, easy bruising, itchy skin, low blood pressure, pain in the abdomen, swelling in the legs and ankles, tremors or shaking, weaknesses or loss of balance, and a constant fatigue or loss of orientation. There are many types of liver problems, but one of the most common is non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, which is a buildup of fat in the liver not related to alcohol. Fatty liver does not always cause noticeable symptoms, but it can eventually lead to scarring and liver failure. To keep the liver healthy is to avoid toxins such as smoking and illegal drugs. Do not share personal items such as toothbrushes and razors that can cause viruses. If you drink alcohol, do it in moderation. Maintain a healthy weight and exercise regularly. Practice safe intercourse to avoid hepatitis infection. Wash your hands and eat a healthy, nutritious food and exercise daily. Seven foods and herbs that can cleanse the liver. The liver has many functions. It removes harmful material from the bloodstream and helps digest food. It works hard performing hundreds of complex functions, such as fighting infections and illnesses, removing toxins, such as alcohol from the structure, controlling cholesterol levels, helping blood to clot, releasing bile, a liquid that breaks down fat and aids digestion. Many foods can cleanse, rejuvenate, and detoxify your liver. This will help to keep your liver healthy and functioning the way you need it to. Here are several liver cleansing superfoods and functions. One, beetroot. Beetroots are powerful food or cleansing for cleansing and supporting liver functions. High in plant flavonoids and beta carotene, they help stimulate and improve overall liver functions. Moreover, beetroots are natural blood purifiers. Simply add fresh beetroots or juice to your daily diet. Two, grapefruit. Grapefruits are natural in vitamin C and antioxidants, two powerful liver cleansers. Grapefruit contains compounds that boost the production of liver detoxification enzymes. It also contains a flavonoid compound known as naranogy that causes the liver to burn fat rather than store it. Drink a small glass of freshly squeezed grapefruit juice or enjoy the whole fruit with your breakfast daily. Three, green tea. By drinking green tea daily, 
you can help your structure flush out toxins and fat deposits while increasing hydration levels. The, the antioxidants found in green tea have also been found to assess liver function and protect the liver from damaging effects of toxic substances such as alcohol. Green tea is also beneficial in treating or preventing liver disease. Who doesn't love a good cup of hot tea? For turmeric. Turmeric is one of the most powerful foods for maintaining a healthy liver. Has shown to actively protect the liver against toxic damage and even regenerate damaged liver cells. Turmeric also boosts the natural production of bile, shrinks engorged hepatic ducts, and improve overall functions of the gallbladder, another structure purifying organ. Mix a half teaspoon of turmeric powder in a glass of water and boil it. Add quarter teaspoon of cayenne pepper, drink twice daily for a couple of weeks. Also include daily into your daily cooking. Five, leafy green vegetables. One of our most powerful allies in cleansing the liver. Leafy green veggies can be eaten raw, cooked, or juiced. Extremely high in chlorophyll, greens soak up environmental toxins from the bloodstream. How important. With their distinct ability to neutralize heavy metals, chemicals, and pesticides, these cleansing foods offer a powerful protective mechanism for the liver. Incorporate leafy greens such as bitter gourd, arugula, dandelion greens, spinach, mustard greens, and chicory into your diet. Six, avocados. As if you needed another reason to eat avocados, they are a superfood for the liver. They contain glutamine as well as vitamin C and E, which act as an antioxidant to neutralize free radicals and protect liver cells from damage. And then there's vitamin E and K in avocados, which act as an anti-inflammatory to protect the liver from harmful inflammations. More reasons to eat avocado. <laughs> Seven, garlic. Garlic is rich in allicin and selenium, two powerhouse nutrients for your liver. They act in cleansing and in nourishing the entire structure, especially the blood. Selenium is a naturally detoxifying mineral and allicin helps ward off immune system invaders, which helps lighten the load on your liver. Garlic also activates enzymes in the liver, which helps overall digestion and flushing out free radicals and toxins. Eat two to three garlics, two to three raw garlic cloves daily and include garlic in your cooking whenever possible. Herbs for the liver. Black cohosh, golden seal, parsley, aloes, dandelion, chicory, goji berries, Is she mute, Jadania? No. Does she have been problem too? The press the 
Yeah, bless them. As, okay. uh, bless the love. The last we heard from you was chicory root. Chicory? Mm-hmm. Right. I didn't is see it. The, it. the greens? That, that was, that is herbs for the liver. Yeah. So I reached chicory, I heard up to chicory. Then there's goji berries, rose hip, ginger and lemon, holy thistle and burdock, both, which is excellent for the liver and for the lymphatic nerve. Water and celery. Celery is an excellent liver cleanser and decreases toxicity and helps balance your cholesterol level in your circulation. So being an organ and a gland, it does two jobs night and day. So let's help it to continue to work for us. I would like to pass the floor over to Jack Lackey on a scripture on the give thanks, blessed love. Oh, give thanks, angel. Blessed love. Bless the love to the family once again. Lord and Empress, Prince and Princess. Yes, so give thanks for such informative reasoning concerning the liver. Our goddess. So I just like to add something again to you know, concerning the liver. Skeptically. You know, as the sisters say which it is our next purifying organ, just like, as I was reasoning earlier on about the kidney. So you see, family, how the kidney and the liver do function like brother and sister concerning mm-hmm. the blood, you know? Yes. Mm-hmm. You know, so we give thanks, you know, for such organs. It even symbolized too, you know, within certain charts, you know, the seat of life now. And it's so linking to the richness of the blood because in the blood is the life thereof now. You know? So I just like to read something concerning what Sister Dion said. She even said, you know, I got to practice intercourse now, you know, which is something very serious, you know, in this life now. So I would just like to read something why it is important to practice safe intercourse so it will not obstruct the liver besides other things. So this is my verse and chapter, Proverbs chapter 7. My Lord and Jesus, royal viewers, from one, the man I, Celestia, I, Jeff, Far I. Yes, continue on reading Proverbs chapter 7 from verse 1. You know, it's like we mother talking to me. You know, and warning you. Like we father talking to me and warning me. Just natural. You know, he said, my son, keep my words. And lay up my commandments with thee. Keep my commandments and live and let and my law as the apple of thine eye. Bind them upon thy fingers, write them upon the table of thine heart. You know, it's just natural. He's showing me anywhere we go. The commandments is the foundation. Now, how we supposed to live, my Lord? He said, bind them up upon thy. You know, table, and write them upon thine heart. He says, say unto wisdom, but what my sister and could understand in thy king's woman, that they may keep thee from the strange woman, from the stranger which flattereth. With her words, you know, he said, For the window of her house, I look through my casement and behold, among the simple one, I discern among the youths a young man void of understanding. Here she see a young man void of understanding passing through the streets near her corner, you know, and he went the way to her house in the twilight, you know, in the evening after 12 to. She, you know, in the black and dark night, and behold, there met him a woman with the attire of an harlot, subtle of art, you know, subtle, subtle mean craft, you know, 
she up to nothing good. You know? She's loud and stubborn to fit her by the nut in the house. Now when she went out, now in the streets and light and waited at every corner. So she caught him and kissed him and with an impudent face said unto him, I have peace offerings with me this day have I paid my vows. And they've been good. You know, he said, therefore I came forth to meet thee diligently to seek thy faith and I have found thee. So you see now she was always marking now. She said, when tapestry with carved wood with fine texture, cloth now. I've perfumed my bed with myrrh, aloes, and cinnamon. Come, let us take our fill of love until the evening. You know, so she invited him in now. You know, to have intercourse with him now. So lace our love. If the home is born, a long journey, we are taking. She forced him, you know, and he goes after her straight away as an ox goes to the slaughter or as a fool to the correction of the stocks. Tell her that strike to his liver. You understand me? As a bird hasted to the snare. I know that it's for his life, so she make him a prey. You understand me? As Solomon saying, apart of the proverbs now, you know? Stolen waters are sweet and bread eaten in secret. It's pleasant now. Nah. You know, because she wipes she out and she says she have done nothing. So it's something no man have to know then that this life you live in my Lord and family and to the YouTube viewers, you know, man and woman life is a very a serious thing, my Lord. A man could go out and just end up with problems for one night now. Nah. You know? So she's trying to be hard then. You know, as we see then, true is liver then, you know, as a bird. So he knew to me now, therefore, we cherish in verse 24, and attend to the words of my mouth. Let not thine heart decline to her ways and go not astray in her paths, for she had cast down many wounded. Yea, many strong men have been slain by her. We see, as you know, Delilah. You know, we could bring in samples still. Her house is the way to hell. Going down to the chambers of death, most eyes. So that's the idea. That's the father. Bless the love, my Lord and Empress, Prince and Princess. This is my ensample towards the liver. I do hand over the floor to Empress Rachel, my Lord and Empress. Hey, Lord. I bless you. I bless the night to the royal family. I bless a night of Daniel, Empresses, Miss and Night, Empress India, Empress Dion, Empress Miriam, bless a night, all Christians, bless a night. My name, my name is Honorable, Honorable Empress Rachel. And my structure tonight is the lungs. What are the lungs? The lungs are a pair of organs situated within the ribcage consisting of elastic sacs with branch passages into which air is drawn so that oxygen can pass into the blood and carbon dioxide be removed. Lungs are characterized, characterized by the eye of vertebrates other than fish, similar structure and present in some other animal groups. The function of the lungs the main function of the lungs is a process of gas exchange called respiration or breathing. In respiration, oxygen from incoming air enters the blood and carbon dioxide, a waste from metabolism, leaves the blood. Um, I'll move on here to seven parts of the lungs which are the nose, the mouth, the throat, the voice box, the windpipe, the large airway, and the small airways. Some facts, some facts about the lungs are a person usually breathes an average of 30 pints of air every minute. The lungs can float on water. 
The left and right lungs are different in sizes and oxygen only plays a small part in breathing. Symptoms of lung diseases, which is three. One is airway diseases. These diseases affect the tubes, which is the airway that carry oxygen and other gases into and out of the lungs. They usually cause a narrowing or blockage of the airways. The second one is lung tissue diseases. These diseases affect the structure of lung tissue, scarring or inflammation to makes lungs unable to expand fully, which is um, restrictive lung disease. This makes it hard for the lungs to take in oxygen and release carbon dioxide. People with this type of lung disorder often say they feel as if they are wearing a too tight sweater or as a result, they cannot breathe deeply. The third one is lung circulation diseases. These diseases affect the blood vessel in the lungs. They are caused by clotting, scarring, or inflammation of the blood vessels. They affect the ability of the lungs to take up oxygen and release carbon dioxide. These diseases may also affect heart function. Pulmonary hypertension is an example. People with this condition often feel very short of breath when they expert themselves. I have here common lung diseases, which is eight, one asthma, two collapse or part of all the lungs, three swelling and inflammation in the main passage that carry air to the lungs. COPD, which is chronic obstructive pulmonary disease. Five, lung cancer. We have lung infection, abnormal buildup of fluid in the lungs and the blockage of lung artery. I have foods for the lungs. Five foods for the lungs. One, walnuts. A great source of magnesium, mm -hmm. an important electrolyte mm -hmm. that helps to support the muscle in your lungs, plus the omega-3 fatty acid in the walnut contains anti-inflammatory potentially reducing lung inflammation and improve your ability to breathe. We have beets. Beets is packed with nutrients that may help lower inflammation with support lung health. It also rich in dietary nitrites, which also have been shown to improve which is a chronic disease. I have here blueberries, often touted as a superfood. They really do offer what seems like an infinite number of health benefits, including supporting lung health. Blueberries are a source of the flavonoid anthocyanin, an antioxidant found to protect the lungs. As we age, mushrooms. Mushrooms are rich with vitamins D, which may help decrease inflammation in the areas and support immunity and general lung health. We have five here, leafy green, like spinach and kale, are packed with antioxidants, vitamins A, C, and E, carotenoids that may help lower inflammation. Eating a diet high in leafy green may decrease the risk of lung cancer. Yes, family, we go on here to the herbs for the lungs. I have five, which is one, licorice. Licorice support lung function and strengthen the respiratory and provide a healthy mucous membrane. I have the second one, nettle. This herb can be cultivated in a garden, a field, and along the side of roadways. Nettle has a way to support the goody information response, which in turn can contribute to better lungs, sinus, and upper respiratory health. The nettle can be eaten steamed, eaten, pardon me, I, pardon, pardon, I. The nettle can be eaten steamed, eaten like a spinach, or steep in hot water and drink as a tea. I have here garlic. Hmm. 
as a compound found, allicin, which acts as a powerful antibiotic agent and help overcome respiratory function that clogs our lungs. Breathes essence, I'm sorry, breathlessness and congestion. It also helps reduce inflammation, improves asthma, and reduces the risk of lung cancer. A happier ginger, ginger offers benefits to our lungs due to its anti-inflammatory qualities. It breaks down the thick mucus and helps to expel out the mucus. It can be steeped in hot water. We have here of oh the super super food turmeric. Super herb. Turmeric consuming turmeric daily reduces inflammation in your respiratory tract. It contains an element called curcumin, which keeps the lungs healthy and makes them strong. Along with this, it boosts immunity by removing toxins present in your body. Honorable family, give thanks. So these are the benefits of the lungs. Give thanks to our family. So lovers, stay healthy, stay blessed, and practice the breathing. Holy Marcus, Ioli Manuelai, Celestia Aija, Rastafari, and in over the that now to Honorable John Blackie. My Lord and Empress, give thanks for such and the lungs, Empress. Yes, you are a family. Yes, to the viewers again. So, as the Empress say, you know, what the lungs do, the intake of the, um, the nostrils, you know, to the mouth and these different parts. Now, breathing work, as we know, can also be a spiritual practice, you know, of one's connection in one inner self. You know, sometimes when we pull in the air and we hold a fire a moment and we let it out, and we pull it up again and we let it out, we feel the circulation, like a relaxed feeling now. So, breathing itself through the intake of air. Very important. So I would just like to bring forth something scriptical concerning the lungs and the breath of life. So we're going to go in the book, Isaiah 43, verse 4. Isaiah 43, verse 4. Because the heavens and the earth were finished, and the, all the host of them. And on the seventh day, God ended his work which he had made, and he rested on the seventh day from all his works which he had made. He gave thanks to the fruit to take our Sabbath. And God blessed the seventh day and sanctified it, because that in it he had rested from all his works which God created and made. These are the generation of heavens and of earth which were created in the day that the Lord God made the heaven and the, and the earth, and the earth and the heavens, and every plant of the field, because it was in the earth, and every herb of the field before it grew. For the Lord God had not caused it to rain upon the earth, and there was not a man to till the ground. But there went up now a mess from the earth and water the whole face of the ground. When we are seven years now, we're going and see the function, the breath of run. And the Lord God now formed man of the dust, of the ground, and breathed into his nostril the breath of life. A man became a living soul. A man will not So without the breath of life, Yes, and uh, man can breathe, my Lord, oxygen. You know, so we give thanks for all strength and power. You know, we give thanks for the listening ear, the viewers. You know, it's about a verse and chapter, so we can be linked, my Lord. You know, to the time, we give thanks every moment. You know, we give thanks to the oil panel for such research. You know, we give thanks to the time of the YouTube family, my Lord and Empress. So... And I now do hand over the floor at this present time to all Empress Maria.
ולימה הקסאי, ולימה נמאי, סלסיה. כן. אז לא סנסן פיתה. Give thanks, my Lord and Empress. Yes, I don't know about the high them, you know, but I've learned a lot here tonight about my goodie, you know, you know, or we must take care of it, you know. Honorable researchers, I give thanks for the high them, you know, because I was eating so much of the good food. Yes, but I did not know, you know, all that it, the medicine that was going to my different organs in my body. And so I am so happy to listen and hear of the, the, the good food that go into each organs to help the organs, to revive the organs and to keep the organs healthy. My YouTube family here tonight, I do hope and pray that you all listen and listen carefully. Because remember now, you only have one goodie. Right, and if you don't take care of it, then you it will be shot up on you. So you apply these, you know, findings to your structure. Give it the good food it need and not the bad ones, because the bad food will hurt you. It will mash down your goodie, and it won't get you better. But the good food, you know, the super food and the herbs. Remember. The father said the herb is the healing of the nation, right? So you apply these medicines that my sister's researchers give thanks to Cindy and this wonderful, you know, findings of our parts, of our goodies. And the reason why we come up with this, we realize that so much people, millions of people in the world is suffering from all these diverse diseases, right? Diabetes, high blood pressure, asthma, cancer, you name it, right? And it's just because, you know, they are not getting the fullness of what their goody is, right? And how we must apply the good food to the, to the structure. We take in the bad food and we get big and fat and say so we are healthy, but we are not healthy. We are sick, right? And so we get together uh, uh, as my sisters them, and we have a reason. I said, you know, we have to help ourselves because while doing the research, we are doing it for ourselves too, right? And to help people, you know, that they can learn about the structure that they are carrying, what or how your kidney work, how your lungs work and how your liver work and the food that will make it strong, right? And the food that it make it bad. So here, family, I give thanks tonight for the Daniel, for Jack Daniel, you know, network who carried this program. And I hope and pray that what you hear, you apply it, you know, the medicine to your goodie. And if you wasn't doing that before, start now. Right, I hope you take down all the medicine and all the food, you know, that can help the, the, the goodie, right? And we will be coming on with more. We thank you for listening, you know, and, um, and all blessing to each and everyone and to the YouTube family, you know, and, and to the Bubba family, I do give thanks. And to my researchers, Jaclaki and Sister Lily, Sister Cindy, Sister Diane, and Sister Rachel, and then to the Women's Freedom Liberation League, I say give thanks and blessed love. I'll turn over now to the Honorable Jadaniel, if you want to say something, and the prayer will go to Jaclaki. Give thanks and blessed love, my Lord and Empress. Yes, Royal Family, yeah, give thanks, you know, to all study group participants, our Women's Freedom Liberation League participants who made this possible. You know, give thanks for everyone who tuned in on YouTube. And we hope that it was you know, beneficial in some way um, to your life and your family's life. And, uh, you know, until next time, this will be a ongoing program, you know, so next time there'll be a different body parts and we'll just keep going until 
until, you know, we have covered everything, which I mean, I don't think that's ever really possible because the body is so complex. So we look forward to hearing more from, you know, this, this group of people. And um, yeah, you know, this is the African Liberation Network. I'm the host, Prophet Daniel. And, you know, again, we give thanks that's for that's everyone's that's presence that's and participation. And, you know, at this time... Blessed we're... love to the host. Honorable. Blessed. Honorable. That priest Daniel. Majesty. Honorable God. Give thanks, my Lord. Good to hear the eye voice. To Majesty. Glorify. Yes, I. Glad to have you on the Liberation Network again still. But of course. I love <laughs> So we have some others listening. <laughs> oh, well, blessings to all. You know. Ju, ju, ju. You're yes. sing a chorus to close it's it. My young, yes, yes, my younger, um, my younger brother, <laughs> Prophet Daniel, Priest Daniel, as the yeah, older brother. Worthy. <laughs> <laughs> Can we request a, a chorus to close it out? You know, being that this was about the blood, you know, um, the blood prevails. Blood and fire yeah. warriors. Okay, I was going to say the blood yeah. prevails if you could sing that one. The blood prevail. You know it, Daniel? No, we don't know that one, the blood prevail. We okay. know the blood and fire warriors. Blood All of right. Negus Ransom. That's him. Oh, that's a cool one. All right, sing that one for them, Jed and uh, Priest Daniel. Daniel will sing that one for me. All right. All right. So, yes, honorable. Come the on. blood of me goes round to me. Ja pay the price and set us free. And everywhere I go, and everywhere I go, I want the world to know. I want the world to know the blood niggas ransom me. The blood of niggas ransom me. A job and a pass free. For everywhere I go. For everywhere I go, I want the world. I want the world to know the blood of me. God's ransom. One more time. The blood of me. God. Ransomy, I pay the price and just set us free. For everywhere I go, for everywhere I go, I want the world to know the blood of me, God's right. In in a holy mouth, Zion, 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 ha, Lord, holy mouth, Zion, Zion. Blood of me, and so me, they pay the price and set us free. I Glorify, give thanks. Bless the love, give thanks, Honorable Empress Miriam and Priest. I go, Emma. 
Thank you, support. Bless our night, peace, Jermaine. Bless us. Thank you, support. Give thanks to his support. Peace, Jermaine. I will have the clock to come down now with the, with the prayer, and then we can have a picture. Sorry, for that, I was trying to wait for this one. Yes, I love the one and all. Give thanks to you for my contribution as well. My Lord. And I'm just waiting to hear you. Our blessings to all of one, uh, Prophet John Daniel, Priest Amen. Daniel, all of one. Yes, Glory to love. Yes. Love, my Lord. love, love, love. Jack Clarky, my Lord, you can bless us with a prayer to close the program out. My Lord, I'm Empress. Prince and Princess, uh, closing, closing Psalm, continue and read in Psalm 150, mighty King David, glory be unto the Father, unto the Son, unto the Holy One of Creation. I will begin in the world, I will be the world, and the last slide, yeah, that's the Father. I continue and read in Psalm 150, praise the Lord, praise God in the sanctuary. Praise him in the fulfillment of his power. Praise him for his mighty acts. Praise him according to his excellent greatness. Praise him with the sound of the trumpet. Praise him with the prosperity and harp. Praise him with the timbre and dance. Praise him with the string instruments and organs. Praise him upon the loud cymbals. Praise him upon the high sounding cymbals. Let everything that has its breath. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Emmanuel, Almighty yeah. King David, my Lord and Empress, for protection, providing son, really going out and coming in. My Lord, our family. Lord. Thanks, my Lord. My Lord. Yes, I. So glorify, give thanks for everyone again. You know, give thanks for our viewers. And at this time, we are signing off. This is the African Liberation Network. I'm the host, Prophet Daniel. This has been a collaboration of the Women's Freedom Liberation League and the Boba Shanti Study Group. Yeah, and give thanks again, you know, until next time. Blessed love, royal family. Yeah. Blessed love, my Lord and Empress. Blessed love. Blessed love.